A partially sighted British pensioner has had his central vision restored after being fitted with a bionic eye. Ray Flynn is the world's first patient with advanced dry age related macular degeneration to undergo the procedure. The condition has meant that he has been unable to see directly ahead out of the centre of his eyes. Instead, he's been compensating by using only his peripheral vision out of the sides of his eyes. The retired engineer is also believed to now be the first human being to have the use of combined natural and artificial sight. The Argus II retinal implant works by converting video images captured by a miniature camera housed in the patient's glasses into a series of small electrical pulses that are transmitted wirelessly onto the surface of the retina. These pulses are then interpreted into shapes and outlines by the brain. Mr Flynn's system was turned on for the first time at the beginning of July and tests show that he could make out the outline of people and objects even with his eyes closed. Well, I could see more or less everything with my peripheral vision, but anything central I just could not see. I can look at you now without the thing and I can not see your face, but I know you're there and then if I move my eye I can see you. Doctors hope this breakthrough will change the lives of an estimated 25 million people worldwide who suffer from age-related macular degeneration. Meanwhile, Mr Flynn, who is a lifelong Manchester United fan, is now looking forward to a clearer view of his beloved football team on the television.